and welcome to another Honest video. Now in recent months I've been looking at the anti-aging products that you can use on the skin, but what about the products that help us from within? Should we be taking supplements to help us live better for longer? We hear and see so much in the news around things like turmeric, probiotics, wheatgrass, vitamins and minerals. Where on earth do we begin? Well, supermodel Elle McPherson got together with her nutritionist, Dr. Simone Laubscher, to try and combine a lot of these popular supplements into one super elixir. And uh, this is part of a range from her Wellco company. Do you see what she did there? She merged the L into the well, very clever. And the elixir is designed to support digestive health, boost energy, help your hair and your nails, and a whole lot more. So the green powder in the elixir is made up from 45 different ingredients, and that includes a lot of the things that you will have heard about in the news that have been highlighted as having health benefits. So you've got wheatgrass, which is associated with an alkaline diet. You've got turmeric, which has anti-inflammatory properties green vegetable extracts that are rich in uh, vitamins and minerals. You have fruit extracts, particularly berries that are um, high in vitamin C and antioxidants. You have magnesium that supports the muscle function, green tea packed with antioxidants and lots of other health promoting compounds. And you're getting them all and more in one go. The elixir also contains four well-known probiotics um, that are there to support gut health. So, so far so good until you see the price tag. I paid £62.50 for this pack of powder here, which comes to about halfway up the pack. That's about $80 in the US, and I reckon this would last you for about a month. When you're paying that kind of money, you have to think very carefully about whether you actually need this as part of a healthy diet. So this is what the powder actually looks like. Uh, the original elixir, which I have, is the pineapple and lime flavour, which tastes okay. You can mix it up just with water, um, but I've been using it to make a banana smoothie using an unripened banana, which has less sugar and is supposed to be better for the gut. Um, I whiz it up together with a little bit of water and make a nice gloopy smoothie out of it. Um, and I think the taste is pretty good. I did notice though that it has a taste of sweetener um, and when I checked it, it actually contains naturally occurring sweeteners like xylitol and steviol glycosides. Uh, both are generally considered safer sweeteners, yet to me, for the sake of taste in a health product, I question why this needs sweetener at all, and that's a little bit off-putting to me. So here's my little elixir smoothie. Um, taking a little sip, you do immediately, beyond the banana that I put in it, of course, get the pineapple and lime flavor, which I think has a nice taste. It works well. Um, you can also taste the wheatgrass in this, and for a health fad sucker like me, that's a that's a plus. Uh, it tastes, it has a healthy taste, but there is a slightly, and I use this word carefully. There's like a saccharin note uh, note in this. It doesn't have saccharin in it, but it's that sort of sweetener taste that again makes me think, why bother with that? Um, I would probably like it to just be that kind of flat wheatgrassy flavor. So the elixir contains four strains of probiotics, which are pretty well known, and we've put along the bottom of the screen to save me trying to pronounce them and making a fool of myself. Uh, probiotic supplements can offer benefits in terms of supporting gut health, but we still don't know enough. So for instance, an important study in Israel found that the response to probiotics changes between individuals and that the health impact will depend on the bacteria that are already present in our gut, and our guts are all made up of different bacteria, so we don't know which are the best ones for us to supplement with. 
What we do know is that eating a diet that's based on natural produce that's packed with vegetables and fruits, aiming to eat different colors every day, is the best possible thing that we can do right now for our gut health. That said, if you don't like fruit and veg, that the reality is you're just not fitting enough in every day, then quite possibly a supplement like that is a good idea to make sure that you're getting a variety of nutrients in. So I've been taking the elixir every day for the past week. I can't say I've noticed a massive difference in energy levels and so on, but that said, I am a person who eats a lot of greens every day and raw fruit and veg. So it may be that I'm already ticking my nutritional boxes, hopefully. So wrapping up on Elle's elixir, it's expensive, but it is packed with ingredients. It has a lot of fans online. And this was actually recommended to me by my neighbor who swears by it. She said she used to suffer from stomach acid and since she started taking these powders, her digestive system is working so much better. So there are a lot of people out there recommending it. Am I gonna continue buying it? Probably not. As I said, I've been using it for a week. I'm going to continue with it to the end of the month. And if I notice any big benefits, I'll do an update. My own view on this is that the best way that we can support ourselves nutritionally is by drinking lots of water, cutting out the sweetened drinks, and uh, generally eating a good varied diet, leaving the super expensive elixirs to the supermodels for now. If you're interested in buying the product or finding out more, I've included an Amazon link in the description box below. You've been watching another Honest video. And if you have enjoyed the video today, there's plenty more reviews on the channel. Do take a look and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.